Greetings, faithful followers. This is your old pal, Brother Jack Angry, along with Ash. And Inferna. And we wanted to take a moment before the show to thank our sponsor, Lovers Luxuries, located at 61st and Maple in Benson, the finest erotic boutique in the city of Omaha. You can visit their website at www.loverluxuries.com or you can Google them and find a location, uh, the, the directions to their store. Uh, drop in, say hi, and tell them the Angry Brothers and Ash and Inferno sent you. Well, ho we hope you enjoy the show. Bye. Bye. Greetings, faithful followers. This is your old pal, Brother Jack Angry. Things are keep improving for us here at the Monastery of Mayhem and with the Angry Brothers Omaha Shakurama. We want to welcome our newest sponsor, Big Brain Tattoos at 1123 Jackson Street in the Old Market here in Omaha. Uh, they are our newest sponsor and uh, we would like everybody to stop on down and uh, say hi to Smitty and Lenny and the rest of the artists down there. Uh, get a price on a tattoo and the next time you decide to have work done, be sure and, and visit Smitty and see what he can do for you. Now back to the show. Jack Angry Sandwich coming up. Greetings, faithful followers. This is your old pal, Brother Jack Angry, along with Sid and Inferna. And we wanted to take a moment to, before the start of the show, to thank our newest sponsor, The Nightmare on Q Street, located in the Funplex on 72nd and Q Street in Omaha, Nebraska. Be sure and check them out. The haunt runs from September 21st through November the 4th and you can check them out by going to their website at www.nightmareonqstreet.com and again enjoy and pleasant dreams and tell them the angry brothers sent you enjoy Bye. i just don't know inferno i can't figure out whether that spell went wrong uh, because we got him back, yes, but he came back as human. Oh, no. So I, I've gone over it, I've consulted with Dr. Sangria. Oh, now wait just a second. He is back. He is back. Yes, hello, Sin, and hello, um, Inferno. What have you guys been doing? Mm -hmm. <laughs> back. Having fun. Hello, ja hello James. Uh, it's, my so, God, it's only nine in the morning and you're having a drink already? Yeah, I know. I'm getting a late start, but... <laughs> Well, as much as I hate to interrupt your drinking, you think you want to focus up? We do have a lot of work today. I've heard from down below, and you're still behind on your quota of work. Well, wow, you're not white anymore. No, no. Well, he's not undead anymore. It's like that's, you know, he's he's a fleshy now. That's how they look. I know, so I could slap him red. There you go. Awesome. <laughs> Yeah. yeah. <laughs> you know, this, this stuff tastes so much better now that I actually have taste buds. Well, it's like we're, I'm sure the liquor industry will be grateful to hear that. But anyway, it's like, are you ready to get back to work now? No, not really. I'm actually kind of having a tough time adjusting. Oh God, are we going to have to find a support? Oops, pardon my language. But are we going to have to find a support group for him for the recently returned undead? No, that just comes handy to us. Yes, because now when, now, when we, now when we beat the crap out of him, it'll take him longer to heal. It'll hurt more. Yes, but uh, remember, I can do some hurting too. Oh, yes, it's like you wouldn't hurt me. It's like I'm your, I, and I'm your older let's brother. Let's talk about the decor around here too. What's wrong Is with it looking a little bright? Yeah. Seriously? Dungeon walls? It's well, it's sweet living a monastery for We got them clean. Gulia cleaned them. Yes, Gulia cleaned everything. I mean, can't you tell? You know, it's like ice and fire right. the hell. Okay, fire the hell. Well, it's like I'm sorry. If you could find someone who works basically works cheap like she does, then I'll be, I'll entertain the thought. But well, we'll put this one in a maid's outfit. That ought to be worth something. No one could muster her apple pie though. Yes. What about her apples? What? Exactly. <laughs> Which pie are we talking about? 
I'm not going. I'm not going there. And oh, greetings, faithful followers. This is your old pal, brother Jack Angry, wondering exactly when the hell I lost control of this conversation. Long weeks time ago. Weeks ago. Yes, weeks along with Sin Inferna. Brother James, who has recently returned from both the undead and the fourth dimension. Give me that. <laughs> Pussy. Yes, it's like, where are you getting your liquor from? And are you ordering out of those discount catalogs again? Yes, being human has some perks, uh, a credit history, <laughs> credit cards, debit cards, bank accounts. And I'm not restricted to sunrise, sunset, that whole thing. Well, some of us like working nights, you know. And some of us don't. I've been having more fun the way I am. <laughs> we always get it. Yes, it's like, <laughs> yes, and Ash is, Ash, is working for city, Ash is working for city government on the East Coast and running the, or I'm sorry, on the West Coast and running our West Coast office. And, you know, we hope that she'll be back soon, but... You know, you never know with those things. But anyway, tonight's movie, Faithful Followers, is a classic here at the Angry Brothers Omaha Shockorama. It's Gamera the Invincible. Now, as you know, the Gamera franchise was. Uh, yes, it's like with this group. Yes, I'll be, I'll be, they'll be strapping me into a pair of adult diapers here pretty soon. But anyway, the uh, Gamera franchise was one, the second major franchise to come out of Toho Studios in the late '50s to early '60s. Second only to, of course, Godzilla. Um, the Gamera character is actually wildly popular with Japanese children. Uh, from my research, it's based on an old Japanese legend about uh, Gamera, which is a nature spirit being the protector of children, and for some reason this has caught on quite... <laughs> what was that? <laughs> Seriously? <laughs> nature spirits? Let, let me sum the movie Let's up for you. Yeah. Rubber suit, uh, bad acting, bad dialogue, <laughs> bad subtitles, moving right along. Okay, it's like once again, you know, I try to bring a little, I try to bring a little culture, I try, little to, bring, human talk there. Yeah, I try to bring a little, um, negative, negative. a little uh, knowledge to the movies, and what do I get? This attitude, and we brought you back, why again? Uh, because we love him. We do? Yeah, <laughs> one of us does. Okay. Oh, yeah. Well, that's between the two of you, and I, I really don't want to think about that. Excuse me, I just threw up in my mouth a little bit. But anyway, um, we're going to get back, get the movie started. Gamera the Invincible, here on the Angry Brothers Omaha Shakarama. Let's see, maybe there's something I could do to get... Make him disappear. <laughs> Let me see. Can you find an interior decorating spell in that book? Maybe something to brighten up the decor around here? Ooh, what are we... Oh, what did you? Why did you come back via via queer eye or something? Dude, this place looks like Alfred Hitchcock threw up in it, man. You're wearing paisley. You're acting human again. Yes, it's you're acting like everything needs to be he's perfect. He's acting like an effeminate We're not, human. Yes, this is. We're not we're perfect. Clothes from the neck down. Well, thank you. Did you notice when I open my mouth, it looks different? Uh, just a joke. <laughs> Wait a minute. She has. She has a head. <laughs> so far, the only thing I like about this gig is them. What would Mother say? Get me my drink, you evil, worthless bastard. Well, that's true, but she was usually talking to you at the time. Anyway. Good to you, Mom. <clears throat> yes, yeah, sorry, right, and on that you happy note. You could show up. Did you see that? They wrote, you could show up. We are being terrible. We need to be more corruptive. Yes, it's like, oh, I did get an email from down below, and they're they saying, talking about you. Uh, basically, um, get back to work, or, you remember the movie The Devil's Reign, which we will be running here in the next couple of weeks, faithful followers, they said that's going to happen to you, and I wouldn't really screw with down below. I'm working on it, believe me, I have some things in the works. 
Mm. Yes. All right. Well, <laughs> this conversation's gotten completely out of control and is going nowhere fast. So we're going to get back to the movie Gamera the Invincible here on the Angry Brothers Omaha Shockerama. Enjoy. Bye. <laughs> Cheers. <laughs> Well, greetings, faithful followers. Welcome back. What do you think of uh, Gamera the Invincible so far? I mean, isn't Gamera scary? Why? No. <laughs> okay, that's Actually, all right. That's bull. getting low. That's scary. Yes, I know. This movie's total bull. It's, Don't lie. That was your third glass. <laughs> yeah, it's like uh, you're going to be flat on your back here before the end of the day, and with any luck. Yeah, well, it's like, you know, I'm the one that's got to answer to down below about you. And your mom. Yeah, and mother. It's like, she's been getting a little scratchy lately. Um, I don't know, have you hidden her teeth again? No, I've hidden her booze, actually. <laughs> well, you drank that a long time ago. It's like, I was there when you cleaned out the bar. Oh, well, she's not going to be needing it. Well, it's like... Basically, it's a well. You <laughs> sure, why not? You drank all her codeine cough syrup, too, and you weren't even sick. No, that was me. <coughs> no, was that was you. No, I wasn't. Moving it was on. him. It was yes, him. well, anyway, so I guess mom, mom is just SOL, huh? That's a good word for it. Yeah, okay, is. it's like, yes, Brother James has a bit of an attitude problem. He's got this thing where he just doesn't seem to care anymore. But anyway. He cares about some things. Yes, I know he does. Yes, and at least he won't be trying to eat Barnard from now on, so... No, Barnard is my friend. Yeah. My only true friend. Excuse me? Huh? Yeah, it's like... He's my four-footed friend. No, okay. Yeah, I was gonna say... Yeah, if you're gonna you don't say wanna mess with Sin right now. <laughs> if you're gonna say she's your four-footed friend, I'm getting the hell out of here. <laughs> yeah, you don't wanna mess with Sin. Yeah, it's yeah. like none of us wanna mess with Sin, believe me. I don't wanna know what four-footed person looks like. You're mad. <laughs> Okay, well this... Aren't you supposed to be in control of this group? I have lost no. control of this group a long time ago. Yes, uh, love you, Chris. We do. Yes, it's like, help me. <laughs> but anyway, all right, so, yes, well... God, you're, you're such a mess. Well, excuse us, we all can't be a fashion plate like you, you sparkly bastard. <laughs> Well, just because I don't look like I live in a coffin. Well, I'm an, I'm a zombie. What do you expect? I mean, there's not a, really a lot of housing for people like of my socioeconomic group. We just kind of shamble around, decompose, and we eat people. Oh, you got the shambles part right. We like to puke too. It's fun. <laughs> you'll, you'll figure that out. You yeah. Yeah, he'll be, he'll be, uh, he'll be in the. Uh, and I trust you'll be around to take care of me when I do. Make sure your head drowns in the toilet, cause you're human. No, we just got him back, and I'm not. What? <laughs> oh, well, she's a demon. She's a demon, after all. I mean, it's like. We can't don't you guys remember eating, trying to eat me? Well, we I'm did. Still a little we did about eat that. you. We did eat you, dear. You just regenerated from your own leftovers. Everything this, went back into place. Yes, and she came, <laughs> in, covered, she came in covered in a one sauce. You know. Oh, oh, oh. That's like yes. a good stick. I got comments, but I'll leave them. Yes. Mm. All right. Well, anyway, we're going to get back to the movie Gamera the Invincible. Before we do, though, I want to uh, pass some tidbits on to our faithful followers out there. You'll have a chance to meet uh, myself, Brother James, and the rest of the crew, Inferna, Sin, and Gulia, hopefully, at our promotion, next promotional appearance, which will be on the 26th of October at the 21st Saloon. And do we have an, ad do we have an address on them? 96 and Ellish area. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, Google it, friends. Yes, you Google all have, it, friends. You all have Google. You all have cell phones. It's the ninety-first amend, uh, twenty-first amendment. amendment. Thank 21st you. Twenty-first amendment saloon. It's in Omaha, Nebraska. We're going to be there uh, third Friday, Friday, the twenty-seventh or twenty-sixth. I apologize. The twenty-sixth at eight o'clock p.m. We will be judging their costume contest, and we will be uh, introducing the band 3D. In your face. In your face. 
So come on down and see them and check out 3D Into Your Face on the web. And do remember to buy your favorite horror host a drink. Wear the awesomest costume ever. I mean, be crazy. Yes. Be and, unique. And if you're a Show your... If you're a female, be hot. If you're a guy, Cover don't bother nipples. showing up. Yes, and we also want to thank our sponsor, Big Brain, for donating uh, their prizes. And we're going to go over those uh, real quickly. The first ten contestants are going to get coupons. That's I discovered something when I was getting out of the shower this morning. I have tattoos. I didn't have tattoos beforehand. I've come back not only as a human, but with ink. Ooh. And I suspect it was all done by Big Brain. Yes, and um, well, nobody's perfect, I guess. I've got a couple of pokes myself from Big Brain, one on my neck and so wrists. So do support the local economy, boys and girls. Yeah. Yes, um, just to let our faithful followers really know, the, for the first 10 contestants are going to get coupons for free piercings. Mm -hmm. uh, the winners of each category will get a coupon good for an hour's worth of free tattooing from Big Brain, the artist of your choice. And the winner of the grand prize will get a $200 gift card from Big Brain. Yay. Yeah! And that can be that used... That's going to be on. We're getting. We have prizes for both balls. Yeah, of okay, course. Cool. So yes, they were. Smitty at Big Brain was incredibly generous, and so be sure if you have them on your Smitty. Facebook. Yes, go Smitty. If you have them on Facebook or you know Smitty directly, give him a call and tell him where to go. We'll also be appearing at Chrome <coughs> Lounge. <coughs> Joys of being human. On the twenty seventh of. Uh, October, which is a Saturday, we'll be appearing there at 8:30, and we will be opening for the band. We will be opening the band John Doe, and we will be judging Chrome's costume contest. And again, the same list of prizes applies. Yeah. So we're just paint. Yeah, we're just paint. <laughs> paint yourself. <laughs> yes, like I said, girls, if you want, if if you want to uh, get ahead, impress impress the judges. You know. And uh, that would be me and uh, Inferna, Sin, Brother James, and Gulia. Some or all of us will be there, and we will be judging the costume contest. We'll also be handing out uh, prizes from the Angry Brothers Omaha Shakurama as well. The grand prize winner not only will get the $200 gift card, and they will also get an Angry Brothers Big Drunk Beer Stein. Woo! I want one. <laughs> I'll be using one probably when I'm there. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> we'll be using it. <laughs> catching up with him. I don't often drink beer, but when I do, It'll I be prefer water, Dos Equis. Anyway, cool. you know, but we can't mention Dos Equis because... I can out drink you, human! I think not. We'll find anyway, out. Anyway, well, before this gets any further... What do I get if I win? Boy, you got me off guard there. <laughs> Well, that's not, that doesn't happen very See often. See joys of being human. <laughs> okay, well, we're going to get back to the movie. Here. Gamera the Invincible here on the Angry Brothers Omaha Shakurama. Oh, gosh. Is there any left in that? Afraid not. Damn. All right, well, greetings, faithful followers. Welcome back, and... That was the conclusion of tonight's movie, Gamera the Invincible, here on the Angry Brothers Omaha Shakurama. Yay! <laughs> yes, yay! Go us! And before we go, we do want to mention to our faithful followers and our fans that we will be appearing at the 21st Saloon on the 26th of October, which is a Friday. Uh, we'll be there about 8 o'clock p.m. Uh, we'll be opening for the band. 3D in your face, and we will be judging the costume contest. Uh, again, our, quite a few wonderful prizes were put up by our sponsor, Big Brain Tattoos. So be sure, and if you're looking for your tattoos, make sure you check out Big Brain. And we'll also be appearing at the 27th, which is a Saturday night, at Chrome Lounge on 84th and Park Drive here in Omaha. We'll be there about 8 o'clock. We will be opening for we will be introducing the band John Doe, and we'll also be judging the costume contest at Chrome. So, girls, get your costumes out, and be sure and come down. Bring your guys. Guys, come on down. 
Be we're worried. looking for the sexiest contest. We're looking for the best <laughs> overall costumes. The greatest, and, whatever. Mm -hmm. um, and the more skin more we see, the better we like it. Yes, that's right. Skin. Yes. Please skin. bring Florida to Omaha, Nebraska. <laughs> <laughs> Skin is in, so the more skin we see, the happier we'll be. Uh, unless you're a dude, and then no, we're yeah, not. Yeah, like no, no. that's okay. We're fine. Yeah, well, we're, we're fine. Well, I guess you no. can come down from that, you know, but we're not going to be very interested. But you come on down for the come on down for inferno and sin and blue. Yeah, I'm sure. You like craziness. Yes, yeah, so I'm sure no, they'll do. they'll love it. We we may have to uh, tie tie inferno into the chair or something to keep her in the chair, but. Anyway, Ooh. now next week, uh, also, and we do want to thank our like good great. friend Bobby Gamister from Virginia. Bobby. Yes, Bobby. Bobby. Ho curator Bobby. of the Monster Museum in Virginia, and I just completely blanked on where, but I hope Bobby will forgive me for that. This episode has also been part of the Whore Host Underground Showcase. We want to throw a big shout out to Bobby and to Uncle Lar for coordinating all this. Uncle Lar! Yes, Uncle Lar. Uncle Lar sends us our shipment of discs from other horror hosts, and we send this out to him, and he distributes it to them. So Thank you. Yes, thank, thank you, Uncle you. Lar. We couldn't do it without you. So, good night, unpleasant dream, and next week's movie... We're bringing you a s truly scary one. We're going to bring you The Devil's Reign, starring William Shatner, Bill. Yes, Ernest Borgnine, Tom Skerritt, and a host of others. Also, this is one of the f little note of trivia. I do trivia, you know. Yeah. This is one of the first films starring John Travolta in his post Barbarino <laughs> roles uh, after his appearance on Welcome Back, Cotter. So. Be sure and check it out. It's a truly scary movie. Is that Does he bite anybody? <laughs> What's that? Does he bite anybody? No, it's not you a vampire wish. film. He just kind of... I don't want to give the ending away, Does but he it's... he move his hips? You know. Well... <coughs> I don't know if that's... <laughs> I just threw up in my mouth again thinking about that. Okay, Inferno, here. That's a mental image I can't scrub off the tape deck. I forgot I had just recently read up on stuff. Yes, Inferno has been reading Fifty Shades of Grey, and it's had a somewhat <laughs> profound effect on her. Has anyone found him yet? <laughs> uh, so we're going to let this go, and we will see you all next week, faithful followers. So good night and unpleasant dreams. Hey, night. Yeah. Night. Well, greetings, faithful followers. This is your old pal, brother Jack Angry, along with Ash and Inferna. And we wanted to take a moment uh, at the end of the show here to thank our sponsor, Lovers Luxuries, located at 61st and Maple in downtown Benson, the finest uh, erotic boutique in the city of Omaha. We hope you'll stop in and visit them and check out their website for really great deals and information about the, the store. And that's at www.loverluxuries.com. And tell them the Angry Brothers and Ash and Inferno sent you. Well, good night and unpleasant dreams. Mwah. Good night, guys. Greetings, faithful followers. This is your old pal, Brother Jack Angry, along with Inferno. Hi. And Sin. And we just wanted to take a moment to welcome our newest sponsor, Big Brain Tattoos in Omaha, Nebraska. Now, they're located at 1123 Jackson Street, which is on the back side of the old market here in downtown Omaha. We hope you'll stop by and see Smitty, the owner, and Lenny uh, and Jason, two of his best artists. And they will be happy to answer all of your questions and deal with whatever your tattoo needs are, whether you're just pricing a tattoo, you have a design, or you need a design, Lenny and his artists will be happy to, uh, to draw that out and set it up to your satisfaction. And all of uh, their work is, all their work is backed by uh, Smitty and his artists, so you'll never go away dissatisfied from Big Brain. So be sure and check them out and tell him the Angry Brothers sent you. And if you'd like to check his webpage out, it's www.bigbrainomaha.com.
Greetings, faithful followers. This is your old pal, Brother Jack Angry, along with Inferno. Hello. And Sin. Hi. And we wanted to take a moment to thank our newest sponsor, The Nightmare on Q Street. And they are located at Funplex at 72nd and Q Street in Omaha, Nebraska. This is one of Omaha's best haunts. Uh, certainly one of their the most scariest. Uh, again, they are at 72nd and Q Street in Omaha, Nebraska. And you can check out their webpage at www.thenightmareonqstreet.com. And again, if you go, tell them the Angry Brothers sent you. And be sure and check out the other haunts in the Omaha area. You'll be glad you did. Now enjoy and unpleasant dreams. Ooh, good night. Good, good night. night.